Revelation 600. From the 1st of October 1938. Faith. Behold, my child, you must have complete trust in me if I am to perform the miracle on you and train you to be a teacher of my word, for the power of my word can only fill you if you accept it in deepest faith. See, what reveals itself to you is always only my spirit. But how can I take residence in a heart before it opens itself to me in deepest faith? My spirit should be felt by you as completely true to life. Every little word should tell you of my love, only then will the essence of the divinity reveal itself to you, and only then will the power of God work in you. All awakening of the spiritual powers in you is only an expression of the Spirit of God, where man cannot completely devote himself to faith, a stagnation will occur until faith is strengthened. Now your will is exceedingly strong and always helps where faith becomes weak, but if you accept my word as unbroken truth, you will grow beyond yourself and be a blessed disciple of my name. Behold, my child, first observe the conduct of a faithless man. Does he not have every reason to despair of life, if nothing teaches him the connection with the hereafter? And how deficient is his trust in help? How empty his life, if faith does not sustain him? But a true child of God accepts everything from the hand of the Father with surrender, he believes and trusts and is therefore never without help. And so faith and trust is the first thing that has to be won by man, only then he can build up all spiritual knowledge on it. That my will directs you, is likewise only to be understood through faith. How else would you like to prove this? You must be pointed to my love and my care for you by faith. Again you have no proofs for it, only the firm faith. Faith is the first and the last, the beginning and the end. Because without faith, you don't recognize your end and also don't live for eternity. But you only see life in its real condition which only makes you highly dissatisfied during your earthly existence. But through faith even the deepest sorrow is soothed, the greatest suffering is alleviated and hopelessness is transformed into confidence. That is why you will only learn to love me in all fervor when you believe with all your heart. What else is faith than recognizing me? If you believe that I am, then you are in the middle of knowledge and then everything else will be easy for you. You will show me respect and honor by striving to do my will and keeping my commandments. You will show me love, and your most fervent desire will be to be united with me. But you will achieve all this only through my word. Accept my word. Let nothing else work in you but this my word. Then you must believe and therefore also love and then you will be my children forever. For if an earthly child sees the Father in me, its faith is not easy to shake. Every word, which comes to it, it accepts without doubt, because the Father considers his child truthfully. He will not lead it on the wrong path or let it go the wrong way. Therefore, my child, let your will, be followed by action. Immerse yourself in my word and believe that I protect every one of my children from all danger of body and soul when this child is filled with desire for its father. And always pay attention to the inner voice which sounds sweetly to those who love me, because my love reveals to them how they reach me and remain mine until all eternity. Amen.